Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I know it's been a hot minute since I've done any type of Bath and Body Works type of video. And I'm so sorry for that. I know you guys are hating me right now, but I'm gonna try, 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 try to get back into it. But I seriously have not been buying anything from Bath and Body Works. And I've kind of slowed down on using things up. Like I have a ton of stuff to show you guys right now, but it really has been like, over the span of two months two three months that i accumulated all of this stuff and i'm so sorry you guys but um i'm gonna try and get back into it especially now that it's hot outside and i'm really feeling the tropical type of scents the fruity type of scents so you guys will probably see me pick back up with my bath and body works hauls and empties videos here in the coming months but um today i have an empties video for you guys but i quickly wanted to show you some things that i actually picked up um once their spring scents hit so let me just show those to you real quick and then we can move on to the empties so i got a full set of waikiki beach coconut i got the shower gel the body lotion and then the fine fragrance mist last year during the summertime i had waikiki beach coconut in the shower jelly and like a little mini spray and so i decided that i absolutely had to pick up a full set of waikiki beach coconut for this summer because i loved it so much the last time that i had it and then i picked up this new scent from them this is called bahamas and it's passion fruit and banana flower so i picked up the full set of this and this is this is passion fruit pineapple leaves freesia petals banana flower and amber this smells so good i love the way that passion fruit smells and i love banana so i had to go ahead and get that and then i got a full set of the bali body care set so this is black coconut sands and this one is coconut milk tonka bean jasmine sea salt musk black sand and if you guys remember i said that i practically love anything that has jasmine in it and then i also love coconut so i had to go ahead and get this because this smells amazing and then i didn't get a full set of this scent and i'm kind of happy that i didn't this is havana which is tropical vanilla and sherry moya oh I don't know if I'm saying that right, but um, this is just a little too powdery scented for me. Like it's floral and it has like a powdery note to it. So I'm kind of glad that I didn't pick up the full set of this. I just got one thing to try out, which is the Fine Fragrance Mist. And then I got three of the Waikiki Beach Coconut Wallflowers. I already put one into my wallflower in my room because I just couldn't resist, but I did get three of these. So that's everything that I got in my little haul. And now we can move on to this, which is my empties. Okay, so first thing on top, this is the Peach and Honey Almond Fine Fragrance Mist. I love Peach and Honey Almond. I don't think I have anything else in this scent because I used up the two body creams that I had. And then I think I only had one Fine Fragrance Mist left. So this is done. I love Peach and Honey Almond and people love this scent on me. So during the semi-annual sale this summer, I'll definitely pick up more. And I actually haven't purchase other than this little haul right here i have not purchased anything from bath and body works since the summer semi-annual sale last year so yeah i haven't been there in a while but then i have this winterberry wonder body lotion i love winterberry wonder it smells so good the scent notes are red winterberry ruby apple sparkling cranberry snow kissed camellia and crystal vanilla this smells amazing it really just smells like berries and fruit and i love winterberry wonder I also finished up the Winterberry Wonder Shower Gel. Y'all know I like to be matchy-matchy with my scents. Not so much anymore. Like, I've started to just use whatever I'm in the mood for. But um, this was back when I was still matchy-matchy with my scents. Then I have... Okay. Then I have a Honey Crisp Apple um, Hand Soap. This is the uh, Gentle Foaming Hand Soap. And it was Juicy Apple, Fresh Sage, and Mold Spice. This was perfect for the fall time. It really just smelled like fresh apples. And then I have a Vampire Blood Hand Cream. I love Vampire Blood during the fall time. It really just smells like a darker berry scented, um, scented type of lotion. So this was really good. I finished up a room spray this is tis the season and tis the season kind of smells like apple pie and spice 
yeah that's exactly what it smells like so this was good during the holiday time this is my peach and honey almond body cream you guys can see i cut it open to get everything out i love peach and honey almonds and this is peaches mimosa flowers honeyed almonds wrapped in creamy vanilla and clementine and to me it smells exactly like all of that you definitely get that peach fruity scent and then you definitely get like an almondy nutty type of scent sweet vanilla tangy clementine and then it also has a floral note so i enjoy peach and honey almond i feel like this is one of the most complex type of scents that bath and body works has that's good And then this is a sparkling pear Riesling. My mom always puts water in the soaps to get the last little bit out. But uh, sparkling pear Riesling smells really, really good. And actually, there's another soap I believe that I have in here that smells exactly like sparkling pear Riesling. It's just a repackage. But this says Anjou pear, sparkling apricot, and champagne essence. Y'all know I love anything with champagne in it. But um, it's a repackage of something. And I don't think that I have it in here. I don't know maybe I do um so this is snowy morning shower gel and this is frosted bergamot mistletoe berry and snow kiss lavender this was kind of a cologne type of scent with a sweet berry note to it and I just used this as a regular shower gel like I didn't have anything else to match this um I didn't really love this scent but it was just a shower gel to have when I ran out of my other scents and then I have salted honey and vanilla hand soap. This was just okay. Like, there's really nothing else for me to say about it. It was just okay. And then I have the champagne apple. What was this called? Oh, yeah. Champagne, apples, and honey. I really like this. Again, champagne, apple. It was really crisp and fresh. And it had, like, a um, bitter note to it, like green apples. It was really good. I really like this scent. And then this was Endless Weekend Gentle Foaming Hand Soap. I will never, ever, ever buy Endless Weekend in the hand soap again because it smells nothing like the body care. So it says white hydrangea, violet blossoms, and sparkling citrus. This was like a super floral, powdery type of scent. It smells nothing like the body care. Just would not repurchase this. And then I finished up a Ghoul Friend Gentle Foaming Hand Soap, which is dark strawberries, ghostly peonies, and spine chilling citrus this just smells like berries and it was really nice for the fall time i really like ghoul friend wild blackberries and basil is definitely a favorite i still have two of these left fresh blackberries sparkling champagne and basil another like weird mix but i feel like it was just so amazingly good i almost don't even want to save the other ones that i have for fall time because it's just so sweet it smells so good um i might not even save them for the fall but this was a really nice hand soap I got some pocket bags here this was sparkling mint blossom this is always a good one this uh hand sanitizer had glitter in it i don't mind the glitter in the hand sanitizers but i know a lot of people don't like them but smart uh sparkling mint blossom is actually a great one it's like fruity and then it has the mint and then it definitely smells like floral like a floral note but it was a really good one and then limoncello sparkling limoncello will always 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 be a favorite i have limoncello in a wallflower right now in my kitchen and it just smells amazing love limoncello i have some wallflowers here so this is toasted s'mores dark chocolate fluffy marshmallow graham cracker it smelled exactly like that and this was actually really strong so it was really good for the fall time white mint latte always a good one this is fresh peppermint white chocolate and whipped milk um i do feel like after a while the milk note is really strong in this and it is kind of like headache inducing so it's good when it first starts out but after a while i just get tired of it but it's still a really good scent um i don't know what this one is but it's a wallflower that i finished and another one that i finished that doesn't have a tag uh, oh wait here's a tag so cinnamon pretzel roll, one of my favorites. This is fresh ground cinnamon, soft homemade pretzel, vanilla cream icing. When this came out, I went crazy and bought like 
five of these this is so good i love the way that this smells it really smells like dough and cinnamon it's a really good one and i love it and i still still have backups of this one this is spiced graham cracker so spiced graham cracker is ground cinnamon cardamom golden graham cracker this was actually really really spicy it was good but it was just a little too spicy for my taste um a candle oh life is sweet vanilla pumpkin marshmallow this was absolutely amazing definitely love this candle as you guys can see it burned down it had a little bit of soot but that was mainly just from me lighting it but it burned all the way down really nice and even this was a really good one so this is creamy vanilla pumpkin spice homemade marshmallow drizzled caramel this is one of those candles that really makes your home smell cozy and like warm and inviting it was actually really really good we had this one in the living room and it just made the living room smell amazing and then this one is another favorite this is pumpkin cupcake pumpkin vanilla marshmallow and pumpkin cupcake are very very similar the only thing is that pumpkin cupcake is a little bit more spicy so this is whipped buttercream madagascar vanilla pumpkin spice and freshly baked cupcake the pumpkin spice is really heavy in this one but other than that it smells just like vanilla pumpkin marshmallow it's very creamy very sweet and then it has that spicy note so then I finished up a blackberry and basil shower gel. This is fresh blackberry, pink pomelo, sweet basil, and jasmine petals. This doesn't smell like the soap, the hand soap to me, and that's, that's what I wanted it to smell like. But it was very fresh as well as fruity, and it was a good, like, just regular shower gel to use. I didn't have anything else to match with this because I got this at the semi-annual sale, like, the last day. But um, it was a really good one, and I would repurchase this. Another wallflower, pumpkin apple. You can never go wrong with this one during the fall time. This is red delicious apple, fall pumpkin, fresh ground cinnamon, clove buds. Smells like pumpkin, smells like apple. Then I finished up a champagne, apple and honey, travel size shower gel. A good one. Poolside pop hand cream. I like poolside pop. I'm using up a um, travel size body cream of poolside pop right now. And I know a lot of people said that they were like disappointed in this scent when it came out last summer, I believe it was. I don't know why. I really like poolside pop. I don't have the scent notes here, but I think it's a good one. Um, Here's another wallflower tag, another toasted s'mores. Um, campfire donut so powdered sugar glazed donut and cedar wood campfire donut is a little bit similar to the cinnamon pretzel roll um i like cinnamon pretzel roll a little bit better um campfire donut i can smell the cedar wood in it um so it's not like as sweet and doughy as the cinnamon pretzel roll but campfire donut is actually a good one I finished off a Better Have My Candy Frightfully Fruity pocket bag. This was actually a really fruity scent that I liked. Another Toasted S'mores. Vampire Blood pocket bag. This is Pink Lemonade Punch, Juicy Lemon, Raspberry Sugar, Pomegranate. This sucked. It was not strong at all. I smelled it for like the first day and then it like died out and didn't smell like anything. I just kept it in my wall like hoping that eventually I would smell it and it did nothing. So it was a waste. Summertime Soda Pop is a favorite. Crisp Lime Zesty Lemon Splash of Soda. I love any of the citrusy soda type of fragrances. They all smell good. Any type of lemon, lime soda champagne any of those sparkly fizzy type of scents i love them so this was a really good one strawberry lemon pocket back definitely a favorite i love this this is so sweet and fruity and then it has a tangy note as well this is so good i'm so glad i have another one of these and then I also finished up a room spray. This is in the scent Almond. I don't know if you guys remember from one of my empties videos a while back. I was obsessed with this fragrance because this is the wallflower that I had in my baby's room when he was a newborn. And the scent just reminded me of him. Like every time that I would smell this, it would make me think of my baby. And so I'm obsessed with this scent. Like 
every time I see it in the store or online, I'm going to pick it up. Candle, wallflower, room spray, whatever it is, I'm going to pick it up. So I do have another one of these room sprays. And then last, I have this strawberry vanilla candle, which as you guys can see, I had to put on the warmer because just burning on its own, I got nothing from it. And this is garden strawberries and fresh vanilla. It smells amazing. And I actually have another one of these. It's just one of those really good, simple type of scents that you expect to just do so well. And it didn't, but you know, I still got the scent from it, putting it on the warmer and I don't know it was good the scent is amazing but the candle just sucks these little four ounces they're always hit or miss so yeah so that is everything for my bath and body works empties video like i said i am going to try and try and try so hard to use up more things and make these videos consistently for you guys like i was doing before and you know just try and stay on top of it for you guys so I hope y'all enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did and leave me a comment down below also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit that bell notification so that you are notified every single time i upload one of these types of videos and i'll see you all in my next one peace